Hey guys and welcome back to another workout. Today I'm not in my living room as you can see but I'm outside on our back patio or little terrace however you want to call it and I just love to work outside. I don't know especially now that the pandemic um, has all the gyms closed. I don't mind at all because my favorite place to work out is outside. So if you can then take your mat outside and breathe in the fresh air. Summer is around the corner and speaking of summer today we are going to focus on our inner thighs. This is not an easy area to target but I know short season is coming up, bikini season and even though we have to practice or may have to practice social distancing even at the beach you want to look and feel your best. All right, we are going to do each exercise for one minute and it's really, really important that you keep proper form. Do as many reps as you can, but always focus on your form because this is where you see the best results. All right, let's start in a downward facing dog position and we are going to do a three-legged dog leg circles. So meet me in a downward facing dog position. Pedal your feet a little bit, wake up your body. Maybe you just woken up or you have been sitting at your desk the entire day or you're on your lunch break, you know. Move your hips around a little bit too, just to get used to the moment. Prepare your body for moving. All right. And then raise your right leg into the air. And I'm going to start the timer and circle your leg around it's also a great hip opening exercise and we're going to change directions halfway through and change directions breathing 15 seconds left on this side and then we're going to switch to the other side and switch switch directions it's also a good booty workout and 10 more seconds you can do it Three, two, one, Whew. and then get back into downward facing dog, pedal your feet again, take a few deep breaths, all right, and then put your knees down and meet me on the back. Next, we're going to do inverted plies, so lay all the way down onto the ground and raise your leg up into the air and then open up your knees to the side so it looks like your leg are looking like in a little diamond shape and then you close your legs and open them again and close and open and make sure every time you close you're pushing something away so this way you are engaging your inner thighs are you ready let's start the timer bonus for also engaging your abs
two, and last one. All right, and then lower your legs to the ground and come to a butterfly position so the soles of your feet are together. And next we are going to do what I call the butterfly raises. So in this position, you're raising your legs a few inches off the ground and come back up. Make sure that your lower back is pressed into the ground. So keep your lower abs engaged. And bonus point for pressing the sole of your feet together. This will work your inner thighs even more. All right, let's go. seconds left you're almost there and four three two and one Ooh. Yes, I definitely feel this in my inner thighs too. All right, next we're going to do a booty bridge with leg opener. So raise your booty up to the air and extend your right leg into the air and then you open it up to the side and come back in. Open up to the side and back up. All right, I'm gonna start the timer let's go again keep your abs tight don't let your booty drop it's not easy but think about how you're gonna rock these shorts or maybe you already shopped a new bikini and always remember it's about how you feel in your body. And five, four, three, two, and one. Come down and rest, put your knees to your chest, rock from side to side a little bit, take one deep breath in and out and let's get going on the other side. Raise your booty up, leg into the air, open and close, open and close. Also add ankle weights if you want to make it a little bit more advanced. This is your workout, so modify wherever you like. And five, four, three, two, and one. Yes, all right. Next, we're going to come onto our left side and we're going to do inner thigh raises. So come down, put your head into your hand and put your right foot in front. Your left leg is straight out, flex your feet and then you're going to raise up and do little pulses. Just tiny little movements up and down and keep your inner thigh muscle as engaged as possible. 
Are you ready? And let's go. This is really really effective. I love this move so much. I always feel sore <laughs> after this move, but it's so good. It's the muscle, the inner thigh muscle is so tiny. It's like a narrow little string and that's why it's so so hard to target. Yeah, I'm already trembling. And five, four, three, two, one. All right, let's, let's switch sides. Come down onto your right side, left leg in front, right leg extended. And lift. Can you go? Let's go. Halfway through. seconds left and three two one and next this is our last exercise we're going to do body surfing scissors so come down onto your belly and make a little cushion with your hands where you can rest your chin on and yeah your legs are a little bit shoulder width apart and then you raise them up and you scissor from side to side all by keeping your legs up into the air you also target your entire booty and this area where your booty meets your back so you get the best of both worlds <laughs> all right let's go in front of you uh, maybe rock from side to side a little bit this feels so amazing and then come back up and we're going to come in a low side lunge stretch out our inner thighs Whew, this feels really really good and then switch sides
You can really give yourself a pat on the back. This was not an easy workout, but I promise you, you will see amazing results if you do this at least once a week. And yeah, follow my nutrition, cook the amazing recipes I have up on the blog. And yeah, you will feel so amazing. There's nothing better than moving your body. And then come into a frog pose. And then, because I love seated forward folds, extend your legs out and inhale by raising your arms up into the air. Exhale, fold forward, grab your toes or your chins, your knees, whatever you can reach and relax. Deep breath. slowly rise back up and meet me in a real butterfly pose this time soles are put together and you can press down your knees with your elbows if you like for even deeper pose fold forward a little bit and this feels really good And slowly come back up and you're done thank you so much for joining me today make sure to subscribe if you like these workout videos I just love to share my fitness routine with you guys and I can wait to work out with you soon bye mm -hmm.